This is a story about going beyond the limit and challenging the unknown. China built the world's highest bridge, which was not only completed in just three years, but also made some American experts feel unprecedented embarrassment. The completion of this bridge demonstrates the great breakthrough of human beings in the field of science and technology and allows the people of the world to witness the miracle that the impossible becomes possible. Let's take a closer look in this video. China's economic development has been on the rise and many large-scale construction projects have come into view including China's Sichuan-Tibet Railway, Baiheaton Hydropower Station, and other large-scale projects. But if people want to say which part of China has the most advanced bridge engineering, they have to talk about Guizhou, China. As the Chinese saying goes, there are 10 high bridges in the world, 8 of which are in Guizhou. The most eye-catching bridge in Guizhou is the Beipanjiang Bridge, which is known as the highest bridge in the world. The total height of the bridge exceeds 565 meters. Therefore, some people say that driving on this bridge is like flying an airplane. Let's take a closer look at this magnificent bridge. Wumeng Mountain in western Guizhou, China, is a typical karst landform development zone, with steep gullies and clusters of karst caves. The Beipan River in the mountains separates Yunnan and Guizhou. Beipanjiang Bridge, located in Guizhou Province, China, has become the highest bridge in the world recognized both at home and abroad in recent years. The construction of Beipanjiang Bridge began in 2013. The design and construction work was jointly undertaken by China West China Design Institute and China Railway Construction Corporation, with a total investment of 1 billion yuan. The suspension bridge across the Beipanjiang Canyon has a total length of 1,341.4 meters, and a vertical height of 565 meters from the bridge deck to the bottom of the valley, which is equivalent to the height of a 200 stories building. At the end of 2014, the main structure of the main bridge was completed. In June 2016, the bridge was fully open to traffic, which greatly reduced the travel time between Lupanshui City and Xianwei City from 5 hours to 1 hour. The entire construction process took only three years, which is an astonishing speed worldwide, and is known as a miracle in the history of Chinese construction. It is 100 meters higher than the Heijijiao Canyon Bridge, the tallest bridge in foreign countries, and successfully aspires to be the highest bridge in the world. However, the construction of the world's tallest bridge has not been approved by everyone. At the beginning of the construction of this bridge, some American experts said that it was impossible to complete such a large-scale project in just three years. They also claim that, even if construction can be completed, the bridge will not last long and cannot withstand factors such as heavy traffic and natural disasters. However, the bridge, which cost more than 1 billion yuan, took only three years from the start to the completion. Scientists used many cutting-edge technologies and experienced countless setbacks, finally making this task that was considered impossible at the beginning a reality. When the Beipanjiang Bridge was completed, American experts were surprised and shocked. They spoke highly of the strength of Chinese engineers and construction workers and said that China has led the development of global construction technology and we need to learn from them. Building this world-class bridge is no easy task with countless difficulties and challenges. First of all, the construction site is in a deep valley with high mountains, so the traffic is very inconvenient. Secondly, the Beipanjiang Bridge needs to withstand natural environmental factors such as huge water flow and wind. 
Finally, the bridge structure is complex and requires extremely high technical requirements. However, through the diligent efforts of Chinese engineers and construction workers, all difficulties were overcome. The double tower cable stayed structure is a common bridge structure. Its design concept is to use two towering towers as the main support and connect the bridge deck with the towers through numerous stay cables. This structure is widely used in modern bridge construction. It can not only meet the requirements of large span and high strength, but also beautify the urban environment and become a landmark building. However, the construction of the cable-stayed twin tower structure is more difficult and requires superb construction technology. During the construction process, it is necessary to consider the close cooperation and cooperation between various parts to avoid problems such as tilting of tower columns and unequal stay cables. At the same time, the selection of stay cables also requires precise calculation and measurement to ensure their quality and safety. Beipanjiang Bridge adopts the most advanced structural design and construction technology. Its main structure adopts the double tower cable stayed structure design, which makes the bridge more stable and strong. The two main towers of the Beipanjiang Bridge are both over 300 meters high. Due to the strong wind in the canyon, in order to ensure the stability of the bridge, the structural design of the main tower uses a very strong reinforced concrete material. The main cables of the Beipanjiang Bridge are made of high-strength steel cables. Due to the great height and span of the main tower, several kilometers of main cables are required to support the entire bridge. The foundation and supporting structure of the Beipanjiang Bridge have also adopted advanced technology and engineering methods. The foundation of the bridge uses concrete suspension piles and reinforced concrete piles to ensure the stability of the bridge under complex geological conditions. In addition, the supporting structure of the bridge adopts a combination of steel structure and concrete structure to ensure the strength and stability of the bridge. The construction of the Beipanjiang Bridge has had a huge impact on the local economy and transportation. The construction of the Beipanjiang Bridge has brought a large amount of investment and talent inflow to the local area, which will help promote the development of the local economy. In addition, the construction of the bridge has also created a large number of employment opportunities and increased the income level of local residents. The construction of the Beipanjiang Bridge has greatly improved the local traffic. Previously, local residents could only travel between the two banks through winding mountain roads or rivers. The traffic conditions are very bad. The construction of the bridge provides a more convenient, fast and safe transportation route for local residents. The construction of the Beipanjiang Bridge has also brought new opportunities for the local tourism industry. The bridge is built on the mountainside and the surrounding scenery is beautiful, providing visitors with an excellent perspective to enjoy the beauty of canyons, peaks and cliffs. The construction of the bridge has brought new development opportunities for the local tourism industry and increased tourism revenue. After the completion of the Beipanjiang Bridge, it will be of great significance to China and the world. First of all, it has changed the development pattern of China's north and south economy, connecting the southwestern regions such as Yunnan and Sichuan with the southern coastal regions such as Guizhou and Guangdong, shortening travel time and promoting economic development. Secondly, it has also become one of the masterpieces of Chinese engineering construction, reflecting China's superb technology and strong strength. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel for more great content. 
See you next time.